president of Hollywood. You, sir, put Gilligan's Island back on the air. Yes, I love it. I, I gotta go. Hi. <clears throat> Listen, it's a very special episode here of, of, the, of, the, of the thing with the Pro Master and the whole thing. It's gonna be exciting. So, I have a problem, among many, and the problem is there's only one of me and not enough of me. Although, looking at me, there's plenty of me. But the important part is that we are so frickin' busy, you salty little communist freaks, that uh, my little nutty muffin poops, whatever I want to call you, um, we are so busy that I'm not going to take any more repairs, at least for a couple of months. Because there's a ton of projects around the building and the, bu and the business and all that that haven't gotten done because I'm just working seven days a week. I took yesterday off. I didn't come in here at all on a Sunday. First time since uh, I took one day off in January, and I believe the day before that was Thanksgiving. That's no way to run a railroad. The old man, which is me, is just not going to survive that kind of abuse. And among other uh, problems, I, we may re we will resume, I assume, but not at the level uh, we're doing it now. It's just too much, too much goddamn work and stress. And. Uh, but I am always available to answer your questions. By the way, I should mention, email is your best bet. I'm always able to give you one of these stickers. What sticker? What sticker, you ask? Look at this sticker. Look at what this does for you. It shows you all that stuff. I'll give you one of these for free if you send a self-addressed self envelope to that. We have videos on the stickers. You should understand this by now. And, um, and, uh... When I get a chance to catch up on all the work, get everybody squared away and square away some stuff with the building and some stuff with the business and so on, then I believe we will resume, although it depends. It depends on how, how much stress I can handle. This repair thing is uh, humbling because the, my stressor is that it's if it goes out of here and it doesn't work, it's not like you're a normal shop where you're just some schmuck down the street and you can bring it back and I can fix it. It's like you're a thousand miles away. We had a truck breakdown that I fixed in Los Angeles. And it's, it's a long story and, it, and I don't know, it leads to difficult outcomes as you would expect. More to the point, um, I, am, uh, I am severely overworked and it's, it's, gonna, it's gonna end with me in my underpants on a rooftop, you know, screaming or jumping <clears throat> or something. And also, in the big picture, I'd like to see my children a little bit more often. I'd like to maybe, you know, get a girlfriend, talk to somebody with a higher pitched voice than mine. As a matter of fact, let me explain to you what my life is like through the medium of interpretive dance. That's uh, what life is like for me. I don't know about you, but... <clears throat> All right, well, there we go. That's a Pro Masters only update. I have uh, some short videos that we may, I may add to this. I may not. But I am happy to field your questions, which you can send to me via email, and I'm always happy to, to you know, take the time to do that, mainly because I can do that at home while I'm lying on the couch crying. Um, ProMastersOnly at gmail.com. And, you know, one of the purposes of these videos is to make answers to these questions so I don't have to type. But I don't mind typing, and I don't mind talking to you. I don't answer this phone. Huh? Technology. How else are you going to call the president of Hollywood? I don't answer that very much because that's it. It doesn't even have a thing or a wireless or a headset. It's a, uh... I dial it with this. You remember this? If you need to press one. It will, how about that? That's Radio Shack quality right there. That's how high tech we are in the telecom department. I don't intend to upgrade either. So anyway, there's that video. Um, as I say, my value uh, to you as a person and uh, to this community of ProMaster owners, I think is stronger in answering questions and also just preventing you, spreading knowledge such a way that you won't be taken advantage of by dealers or that you'll, you'll come into any automotive problem armed with at least some knowledge. Because I'm sure you've noticed, the problem is car, modern cars are extremely complicated and they can be very expensive and you are at the mercy of unscrupulous repair places who say, oh, it needs a transmission or oh, it needs an engine. Which is very frustrating uh, because you don't, you're not, can't be expected to become knowledgeable on 
on all these systems. This is not like a 65 Plymouth Valiant station wagon, which I own and would like to work on again someday, get it running so the kids can drive it to school. Um, the important part is that uh, I feel like I can, I'm not answering that. I feel like I can bring that to the community. Um, uh, all right, all right, love you. Okay, thank you. Tell the missus I love her, too. <laughs> All right, bye. Okay, where was I? Time for soup. By the way, once I drink the full pot of coffee over the course of the day, I switch to soup. It's delicious. Just powdered bullion. Can't go wrong. All right, where were we? Ah, hell, I forget. All right, anyway, so we're going to be in a slowdown mode where I finish up the jobs I have, and I cannot take any more of your jobs because it just gets, it just puts it more and more behind and it's not that when there's a problem then that puts the next job behind and then people are angry and so on and so forth and it ends up costing me and i, I don't want that the future though <clears throat> is quite bright because let's imagine for a second you and i could talk that i don't take any more repairs as a as a as a daily kind of thing but i have a couple of ideas for products that are going to be really cool um, really useful and are long overdue in this community that, that will solve problems and maybe create problems, which is always fun to be on both sides of the equation. Um, I would like to work on those. I'm going to share what those products are with you just for the hell of it. One is a turbo kit that you could install yourself. It's quite some clever things I've got going on with that. I figure adding another 40 foot pounds of torque to that engine would prevent the downshifting that everybody complains about and, uh, you know, it would be quite exciting. The other product is, you know, the pods, the bumper at the big pod on each side of the grill. There's nothing inside those pods. It's empty space. It's not crash structure. It's not sound deadening. It's nothing. It's just a plastic cover. You could come up and hump it and it would fold up. But that pod, if I were able to uh, cost effectively fabricate that in sheet metal, would be an amazing place to put a generator, a suitcase generator, or a battery bank, or a diesel heater because the diesel heaters the cheap ones as you know even the expensive ones they're useful but they make noise and and they smell if you leak the fuel and they require cutting a hole in the floor and all that none of that would be there if i could figure out a way to make those pods into actual cargo space if not just for empty cargo space because who wouldn't want another i don't know 12 cubic feet or whatever of trunk space in the front of the van um all that stuff is, is totally separate from the actual crash structure, and it's, it would be perfectly legal to put anything you want up there, including just space. You could, you could store your disco boots in there. You could, you could put your marital aids. You could do, you know, your, your, your arrow through the head sunglasses, whatever you got. Um, developing those products would be, uh, and, and, and installing them if it needed, would be a much more uh, personally and emotionally satisfying thing for me than just always being behind the gun and deadlines for repairs and panic and then somebody's stuck here or I got to go tow something. You, you understand. Anyway, so I listen, listen, I'm glad we've had this time to talk. I'm glad we had a little mono e mono or mono e unknown or, mo or mono. And, uh, and there it is. I will be in touch, kids. Again, Promasters only. You got the email, Promasters only at Gmail, and uh, it's going to be fun. I'm, I'm, uh, an unknown future is more interesting than a known one. Wouldn't you agree? I figured you would. Okay. Got to get back to the president of Hollywood.